I'll leave you two to the Burger Wars. Oh, forget that. Now, what was I thinking? You know, we need to be doing something to cheer up poor Ted. I mean, a party, or lasagna maybe, that's it. But I'm going to need your yes, help. I, I, I don't do lasagna. Well, um, I don't cook. Um, this is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. A tablecloth that you brought from Mexico, the, the red one with the uh, sequin on the edges. Uh, you, you know, um, but you know, it's in that linen closet back there, way up top on the uh, shelf. I think it would need, well, a veritable giant to get it. Could you help with that? It's uh, right over here. And it'd be just so great if we had something festive, you know. And that tablecloth surely is. It's right here. See, up there. If you could just... Uh, this is a demonstration uh, of Flip for Mac. It. I think I can get that. Yes. Oh, good. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, I have never bought a red tablecloth with sequins on it in my entire life. What is going on with you? It's for you, time. Now you get in there and fight for your man. <laughs> This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. Paul, open this door right away! Opal! Oh, what? What? What, what is it? What is it? Right now. Quick, the light switch! Oh, oh, my eye! Oh, sorry. Quick, the light switch! I can't see! Well, of course you can't see. It's dark in here. Get a match, get a flashlight, anything! Oh, oh, not a moment too soon. Where is that crawly thing? Is it still on my neck? Oh, here, here, here's your coat. This is a demonstration of well, Flip for Mac. It could have been a rat. It could have been a bat. Oh, I'm going to give Opal a big piece of my mind as soon as we get out of here. I, I, I'm sure you will. I beg your pardon? As if you and Opal didn't set this up. How dare you insinuate that I set this up? You insinuate nothing. I'm accusing you outright. Well, you are dead wrong. No, this stunt is... This is a demonstration uh, of Flip for Mac. I didn't even know you would be here. Well, your improvisational skills are excellent. Well, your ego is infuriating. Well, how did you and Opal communicate? Hand signs? Secret code. Oh, well, you might as well know, yes. Opal and I are government agents. And uh, if we pull off this caper, there will be a sign to the WHLC, the White House linen closet. God help the president. Dimitri, I swear, Opal is up to something, but I have nothing to do with this. Oh, this is fucking This is a know. demonstration <laughs> of Flip for Mac. Say funny? Oh, yes, yes. You know, considering all of the childish stunts that you've pulled. Name one. Well, a uh, case file that comes to mind. Uh, the kidnap caper in Budapest. Your brother. Edmund's idea. I was nothing but an innocent pawn. Oh, you're innocent, all right. You feigned uh, amnesia so that I feel sorry for you. That was ages and ages ago. Well, uh, today's proof. I mean, the tactics are timeless. You were hoping that we'd be... This is a demonstration a of Flip so for Mac. I would give in to you. You just left out one important factor. Your humongous ego. Mothballs. They're not conducive to reconciliation. This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. Oh, here, come on, drop the act. Opal is not going to open that door until you give her the signal. Now is as good a time as any for me. What's your hurry? My little nephew happens to be in the hospital right now with pneumonia. Little Sam? Oh, Demetria, I'm so sorry. Well, if, if you mean that, give Opal the high sign or whatever and let me get going. Well, of course I mean it. Little baby shouldn't suffer. The door? This is a demonstration of Flip time. for Mac. I am not in cahoots with Opal. For all I know, you are in league together. Me? Absolutely. Staging this accidental encounter would save wear and tear on your masculine pride. Ooh, I don't believe this one. Oh, spare you the palm-sweating embarrassment of picking up the phone to call me. Well, if I wanted to call you, I would call you. Well, I have news for you. If you call this me, is I a demonstration of Flip for Mac. I 
am not having this conversation. I have better I things to do with my life than sit around the house all day waiting for you to call me on the telephone to say that you forgive me. As you know, I am hard at work on my second book, Erica Kane, Beyond the Pain. Offers have been flooding in. I have gotten bids from every major publisher in New York. I am so happy for you. I... Really. Now, can we just uh, can the talk about the book and maybe concentrate on getting out of here? This is a demonstration um, of Flip for Mac. You're the man. Do something manly. Use your brute force. What should I do? I don't know. Anything. Please, do anything. Use your imagination. This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. What are you doing? We want out of here, right? This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. What are you doing now? Oh, I'm about to apply my infamous brute force. You're not going to break down that door. Yeah, I'm going to give it the old college try. Oh, you're as crazy as Opal. <sighs> Solid oak. Yeah, like your head. Reinforced hinges. Yeah, well, you know, I think if I get the momentum going, I hit it right on the right angle. This is a demonstration of Flip for or Mac. If you break your shoulder, and then where would I be? Opal, this is your last chance, Opal, to open this door. If you don't open this door, Opal, I swear I'm going to tell Palmer. Well, I don't know what I'm going to tell him, but I'm going to make up something. Opal! Opal! Erica, just stand back and let the master at it. Well, be careful. This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. Those hinges are a little stronger than I thought. This is a demonstration like of Flip for Mac. Closet in here. What happened? Did somebody fall? <laughs> no, Opal, I was trying to knock the damn door down. Well, what did that poor innocent little door ever do to you? The door was locked. Well, I was going to let you out sooner or later. I was just waiting for it to get nice and quiet in here. I guess my plan was a bust. Oh, there. Did you hear what she said? Her plan. Her plan. <laughs> Plan. I told you I have nothing. This to is do a with demonstration a of Flip for Mac. Yeah, I got the idea from a Doris Day Rock Hudson picture. You know where Doris plays an uh, interior decorator, and Rock is this fast and loose playboy type. And well, anywho, it's a oh, great picture. It's the lamest idea you have ever had. Oh, you're just mad because you didn't think of it first. Life is not a Doris Day movie. Well, maybe it should be. I mean, Dodo gets to wear all those drop-dead gorgeous gowns. This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. Back and forth between Cary Grant and Rock Hudson, and she's kind to strays. If you ask me, the world would be a much better place if everybody would just kiss and make up and say, move over, darling. Yes, well, uh, I would like to inform you, uh, Opal, that uh, for one stupid stunt, you get one thumb down. Two thumbs down. Oh. If you'll excuse me. This is a demonstration of Flip for Mac. <sighs> well, 
looks like intermission. So, what happened in the first reel? You blew it. That's what happened, Opal. Well, excuse me for living. I was just trying to help. Well, if you really wanted to help, you would have locked that door and thrown away the key. 